So yesterday we worked on multiplying fractions. Today we worked on, on dividing fractions, okay? So before we can do that, we need to make these mixed numbers fractions. So step one, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna automatically do this on the original problem. I'm gonna do that on the original problem. Now I'm gonna make them fractions. They're mixed numbers now, not fractions. We're gonna make them fractions. We'll bring my three down, my nine down, put a division sign. Then I'm gonna do the math. Five times three is? 15. Plus two? 17. 17. Then nine times two is? 18. Plus four? 22. 22. That's step one. Step two, I'm gonna write K, C, R, I'm going to put that F. What does R stand for? Reciprocal, Reciprocal which means? Flip. It means flip. flip. So I keep the first fraction. I change the sign. I do the reciprocal of this, which is, it means I flip it. So I'm going to flip it. Now, what's the problem? Oh. 17 times 9, I'm going to do what? Does it mean the, the third step means I multiply. So... That's 153, and what's three times 22? 66. 66, so I multiplied it, and I got this. What is a fraction that's greater than one? Mixed What is a fraction that's greater than one? Oh, it becomes, problem. What kind of problem? A division. A division problem. So we know, because we had two mixed numbers, we know that our answer is gonna have a mixed number. We're gonna bring out, we're gonna bring this, uh, and I forgot to do this. Make sure y'all connect them. And we're gonna bring our de uh, denominator over. Now it's a, it's a division problem. Y'all divide it. What we got? Uh, okay. two. 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 Then what are we gonna do? Multiply. Multiply, multiply two, two times sixty-six. What is that? One. Got a calculator. One thirty-two. So I'm gonna subtract that. One one fifty-three minus one thirty-two is. Got a calculator. Twenty-one. 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 So here we have. 2 and 21 over 66. But I need to reduce that. So what number can I divide both of these by? 3. 3. How do you know? Because 3 times? 7 is 21. Seven. Then 3 times 20, 22. 22. 22. And then okay. 3 times 22 equals 66. Okay. So here we go. So that's our GCM. So we have 2 and this is what? 21 divided by 3? 7. 7 and 22. 22. So that's our answer. Everybody good? Yes. yes. Okay.